Hey ya! It's Whimsy and we're back today with a new episode of Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. We are going to continue in the Corel Prison and we are going to do a Chocobo race. So I'm very excited for that, so let's jump into it, let's go! So off camera, I did the battle, uh, I don't remember what it was called, battle, kind of like a Colosseum, I guess, and I actually I wanted to do those uh, purple dots off camera because I thought, oh, it's not going to be interesting, but then this is quite interesting i think i need to find the the truth or like who lies basically well do you think you can so i'm very interested there, say, and i, I thought oh maybe it's gonna be fun to do that on uh, on camera you know so i just got the like map me. like this um and i haven't talked to anyone so i think i need to ask i'm gonna be drinking this number to... one hey you ever heard of a place called bail jumper yeah, the finest booze around, pure as the driven snow, not watered down one I know bit. that's a lie. I know that's a lie because they, they water it down. Okay. Alright. Um. After that we have number <laughs> two. I gasped when I found out the weapon shop sold elixirs, which immediately got me kicked out for making noise. I think it's true. They do sell elixirs there, I think. You gotta check out Garf's autobiography, Meditations on the Underling Life. It's at the local bookstore. Gus's crib is covered in graffiti, like some kind of art museum. My personal favorite is this adorable Del Sol cactuar. Have you tried the Beast Battleground yet? I hear that Type Zero monsters are real toughy. The they are. That is true. Uh, okay, so I think num well number five is well, definitely. Do you think you can figure out who's telling? You got it. Have you tried the Beast Battleground yet? I hear that type. <laughs> Oh, too bad. Huh? I'm afraid but you've they were been type hacked. zero. My though. pupils have a knack for the art of deception. Well, discerning the truth is a skill, just like telling a lie. Huh? Now then, what say we take it from the top and have you try again? A different swindler is now telling the truth. <laughs> you know, is run by mail jumpers sometimes. Their own specialty sunshine is like nothing you've ever tasted. Oh Promise. lord, okay, that was weird. The weapon store owner's got a few screws loose if you ask me. I mean, what's he doing selling potions of all things? Well, fuck, I I'm think it was too. I'm dying to read Gus's autobiography, Meditations on the Outlaw Life. But the bookstore still doesn't have it in stock. Gus's crib is covered in graffiti, like some kind of art museum. My personal favorite is this adorable Del Sol cactuar. Have you tried the Beast Battleground yet? I hear that it type is number zero four. Mark. Well, do you? <laughs> I know I could go and check. I'm dying to read Gus's autobiography. Gus's crib is covered <laughs> in. <But> <laughs> <laughs> oh. It costs. It costs You've me five hundred. Once again. Gil every Better time. Luck next time, friend. Hey, you ever heard of a place called Bail Jumper? Yeah, the finest booze around, pure as the driven. The weapon store owner's got a few screws loose if you Potions ask me. Potions or elixir? You need to get yourself over to the local bookstore Meditations and have a copy of all Gus's You checked out the graffiti at Gus's place? He's got a Del Sol cactuar in there. See if you can find it. You should test your might in the Beast Battleground. Name what? They've got what? a rare monster named Bug Zero. Now, that's, that's not true. Huh? Okay, uh, so let me check number two actually, because I'm... I thought that he sells elixir, but maybe I'm mistaken and it's potions. So we can definitely check that out. Okay. Make a peep and you're gone. That's a promise. Elixir. Though, so number two was right. Don't I should have chosen no, number two. 
I was in I wasn't as sure at the, as the type zero, but I guess it's not called type zero. Maybe it's called like experiment zero or something like that. I don't remember. Um, there must be like a, but it was number two, the the right one, in the first the first round. <laughs> I would have gotten it first try, dude, if I had listened to myself. Okay, wait. So, I also was wondering about the books thing. Which is number three, I think. Need some. But I don't think I don't think it's here. Thanks. It's a uh, mag 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 magnata. Uh, welcome to my humble establishment. Please meditation. What? My store will always She said something about meditation. <laughs> meditation on the other of life. Okay, so they have it. I don't remember if they said they have it or they don't. I'm so stupid because I would have gotten it first try, dude. Have you read Gus's autobiography? Okay, that's Meditations on the Outlaw Life yet? You can. Well, that's it, right? Do you that think you name? can figure? Yes. Have you read Gus's auto? <laughs> Good job. Congratulations! Their deception was no match for I mean, your it was powers of perception. At first. Beware, my aspiring swindlers. Clever ones like this are harder to fool. But so long as you continue to train and apply yourselves, I can teach you to swindle even the toughest marks. Yes, yes sir. sir. Ah. As for you, rest assured that I am a man of my word. Thank you. Those greens are hard to find in a place like this. Quite the handsome reward, wouldn't you say? <laughs> hey, keep it moving. <laughs> okay, they have no one. Uh -huh. <laughs> 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 they have no lines <laughs> apart from the swindling all right oh we have one last um we have two i think two two others okay that's the shop oh there's a oh okay i um i had not seen that desert desert rush I forgot about that Let's go see. Well, now we have a green thing. I already gave the other. But I, I don't really like what it gives. I prefer this sample. Uh, I mean, maybe the headdress is really cool. You scrounge up more veggies, you know, having trouble. But we'll desert. Yeah, we'll go see desert. Where is it? It's right here. Here? Oh, there's a rush. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Here. <gasps> no way. It's boxes. No way. No way that it's box. Oh, I'm so hyped right now. Okay, let's go. Mr. Gus presents. The well, one. good thing I didn't see. Well, the I would have kept it for the Desert on rush. camera. For a limited time only. Good thing I didn't if see it though. Score, you'll get some rare greens. Didn't do Step it off right camera. <laughs> De-stress like the the relics of the dust boy bowl by whacking some boxes. Destroy as many boxes as possible within the time limit. Each box broken will add to your score. Reach the target score before time runs out to win. In order to break gear boxes blocking your path, you must first destroy enough shock boxes to power them. Devise a plan to of attack using the hit activating elevator to move between floors and walk your way to victory. Interest. Thing. Dragon Claws! New weapon for Tifa. Let's fucking go. I hope they're doing good too. Woo! No holding back. Okay, I see. Oh my god, the music. Let's do this. I see. And now you do this? Is that so okay? Gotcha. Go. 
gotcha. Let's do it. Brace yourself. <laughs> the music is so good. Okay. Oh. Okay. Here we go. Okay, yeah, I need to find a uh oh here. Let's do it. Here we go. All right. Here we go. Oh, okay, I see. Oh. Okay. Sorry. Gotcha. Okay. <laughs> gotcha. The music, dude. Okay. Brace yourself. Nice. Okay, there's this. Oh, I see. Oh my god, dude. Okay. So long. No, that goes down. Uh, I mean, that's okay, I guess. We can she just jump? No? Guess not. All right, uh, we'll go up. Uh, okay. Oh, shit. We need to find another right here. Sorry. A little bit of time. All right. Uh, we're missing. Oh. Okay. Gotcha. So long. Here. Let's do it. All right. Sorry. Okay. Very nice. Oh, I have only 14 seconds left. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Yeah, I won't have the time for anything. Ah, there was one there! No! Ah. I tried. <laughs> okay, I uh, I got the. Uh, I understand what to do. <laughs> it was like a tutorial, Great you know. Job out there. We still got rank two. That's not bad. We were actually close to rank three on first try. That's not too bad. Here we go. Sorry. 
No holding back. soon, but I think we're gonna be okay. Oh shit, I can't go on the other side? Okay. So <gasps> long. We did it! Let's go, dude! Oh. Let's fucking go! I don't know where to go now. I have too much time. Oh, come on. You're terrible. Going for the ones I missed. <laughs> Here we go. I probably missed some things somewhere. But we did it, anyways. Probably the max is 45,000. Wow! You got some real talent there. Thank you. Yes! I wonder if there's like other. Have a good day. Hope modes. to see you again. Nice. We did it. How come y'all get to eat veggies? Hey, nice find, Merc. Here we go. We got all the weird ass. That's all I got. Now go and kick the tar out of those other jockeys. I mean, it's not that weird, but I don't know. I'm not sure it's gonna fit a chocobo, you know? We we can try. Okay, that's kinda cool. That's kinda cool. Okay. But <laughs> But uh, no, I just really like how cute it looks like this. It's still cute. I can't. 
but the head the head is kind of cool all right i think we're good to go um i haven't been there i wonder maybe. so you ready or what maybe it wouldn't have worked sure about time let's get this show the on race. the road come with me actually on second thought i'll take him up top that work for you say what <laughs> fine you want to go roll in the hay with this idiot go wild um and on that note follow me excuse me it's hard to believe this is the same pico that nearly died in the desert you should have seen him that first day the poor boy more dirt than chocobo couldn't so much as give us a quail without coughing up sand mm -hmm. he's a whole new bird now though might even have what it takes to win question is do you even the fastest chocobos can't win jack without the right jockey i've seen my fair share of promising birds wasted on riders who didn't know their asses from a hole in the ground <laughs> believe me in the racing world it's all about who's holding the reins no pressure though i don't need a lead like that when i'm with Pico in the wild okay on you go what's going on it's just following me let's go cowboy shoot for the stars Competing in the race today? Yep. Chocobo school. We'll get your bird prepped for you. Just sit tight in the jockey lounge. Beep, 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 and no wandering beep. off, okay? <gasps> the scorpion attire, but the color of the chocobo is so cool. Oh my god. Okay, I like the little bow with the flower in the middle and the moogle. <laughs> oh, we have uh, almost the same style. I'm sorry. They're so cute. Hey, you look like Belle. And this is my Pico. Okay, some of them look really cool. Maybe I should have put the attire that they gave us, but I don't know, it just didn't fit right. But it was supposed to be like this unique Up thing, you know? Boy. Huh? <laughs> hey there, Joe. I'm a Why, Esther, you grow lovelier by the day. <laughs> uh-huh, sure I do. Oh, where are my manners? This here's Joe. He's one of Sam's jockeys. Uh-huh. And as much as it pains me to admit it, the man's far and away the best rider in the sport. Uh-huh. A pleasure to make your acquaintance. This is Cloud. An up-and-coming star of the track. And all ours. Be sure to wave high when he laps you. Well, sounds like you got a fan, son. How do they know I'm gonna win? Though. They don't know me. You win her over with your skills? Or with one of them smoldering looks. <laughs> Don't see why it can't be both. About time I had some competition. Assuming Esther's not full of it. For both our sakes, I hope she isn't. <laughs> the stress I'm under. Forget him. The race like, is starting soon, why? so stay focused. Speaking of, you might want to consider practicing. The sim here can help with that. Yes. Good idea. I don't understand why the like I arrive at the prison right and and they're like oh you're gonna do this for us but they have no idea if I can ride well like so not strange. gonna do a few laps for practice but yeah 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 I'm sorry I will I just wanted to I'm talk. just brushing up on my bird <gasps> calls before corn, the race I want it hey, I'm trying to manifest oh, I'm a hungry wind here. now. I'm so hungry. Or take a team up. Take Joe down a peg. Mm-hmm. Alright. Let me do that. Teach me game. 
If you want to brush up on your jockey skills, you can practice on the racing simulator. Even if you have never raced a day in your life, completing the sims various tutorial objectives will ensure that you are ready to compete. Oh, you can drift. Speed up, slow down, drift. Nice. Press X right after the countdown hits 2 to begin the race with an explosive start. Right when the cannon hits too. You may end the simulation at any time. Okay. Okay. No problem. Let's do it. What are those? <laughs> Speed balloons. The more of these blue balloons you collect, the faster your chocobo will run. Each balloon raises its bird, a bird speed level by one for a maximum of ten. Know that when you run into an obstacle or collide with other chocobos, the speed level will decrease. Oh, interesting. I'm sorry. Interesting. What are those? Ability. Ah! It's basically... Uh, a Mario Kart and I'm I don't wanna brag but like I'm not bad at Mario Kart <laughs> Collecting these red balloons will fill your uh, uh, chocobo ability gauge. Once the gauge is full press L1 to activate your chocobo ability. Remember that each type of chocobo has its own unique ability. Uh huh. Collecting these yellow balloons will you can fly add a charge to your dash as long as you have at least one dash charge you can press r1 for a short burst of speed you can only stock as many charges as there are in your dash gauge though so use them when you can gotcha okay that's bad gotcha All right. This is nice. Okay, so I just go like really fast. I see. I'm not sure I'm supposed to do that. All objective complete. Okay, cool. Now that you have completed the tutorial and learned the ropes, you can race in a chocobo cup. Good luck. Let me just go around one last time. I don't know if it's the same track, you know. So I also have a speed burst. I saw it, but I, it didn't register at all. <laughs> okay, so, but if I touch other chocobos, my speed will decrease as well, so you need to be careful about that. Hyperion is Joe's bird, and it's a fast and rugged son of a bitch. Things bred to win. Hyperion, eh? Okay. Your first race ever, and it's with Joe. Oh, it's only the two of us? Just the two of us. You better do right by me and Pico and not lose today, you hear? Especially not to one of Sam's birds. Our next race will begin shortly. The green room is nice. Jockeys, I guess it's like a green room. Proceed to the paddock. Kind of. The waiting room. You good to go? Yes. And I'm not just gonna win, I'm gonna fucking destroy that dude. <laughs> Each bird is unique, but they all possess the following attributes. Speed, acceleration, weight, cornering, strength, 
and intelligence. Depending on the distribution of these attributes, a bird can be faster or easier to handle. For a more in-depth breakdown, speed and acceleration will obviously make chocobos run faster. More weight will make them fly shorter distance, but also be harder to knock around. Cornering helps chocobos turn better. Strain keeps them from slipping around, and intelligence affects the pot potency of their chocobo ability. Okay, gear. A chocobo can wear gear on three different parts of his body, the head, torso, and legs. Each piece of gear has its own set of attributes. Okay, in addition, gear comes with a unique skill that activates automatically when you meet its conditions. You can save up to four sets of gear, three racing sets, and one world set, which is the gear your bird will wear while it shuttles you around the world. Uh... Okay. I... I will keep world like this. Um... What is Mimic Cry? Toggle info. Randomly replace your current ability with a different one you possess. Slightly increased speeds for a few seconds after being passed. Oh, that's interesting. Dramatically increase all attributes if placed seventh or lower, heading into the final lap. Increase weight, increase acceleration, increase speed. Gain a dash charge upon entering the final lap unless your charges are full. Increase number of dash charges by one. Increase chance of dashing out of the gate and increase speed on success. Increase speed proportionate to distance from... <laughs> I like naked. It's cute. From the first place struggle during the last lap. Interesting. Okay, that, that, could, uh, that could be good. Efficacy F <laughs> of items picked up. Listen how much you slow down when damaged. I do like that a lot. Listen how much you slow when you leave the track. Increase dash speed. Start with one dash already available. Definitely increase speed dramatically after recovering from going out of bounds or crashing. Increase the effect of dash panels. Okay, that's kind of cute. I was thinking maybe increase weight. Let me see again. Harder to knock around. like this we can try and it's a cute a cute assemble a cute mix we can do it pico we can do it pico Koopa. okay i'm not even dressed for the occasion i'm just cloud you know just normal attire cloud <laughs> You good boy, Pico. All right. <laughs> What's going on here? They love their job. Mm. It's cute. Uh, Cloud didn't it's even look. He does not I care. I that recent shooting. Oh lord. You're not talking about the Colosseum, are you? Yes, I was there. Wait. Um... Or I would have been had I not gone to the bathroom just before. That's amazing. You're was so he lucky. there to kill him Aren't then? I just? Which is why I know my bird's a winner. <laughs> His hair. Ooh, what a scrumptious looking parfait. And with plenty of butterscotch, I see. Bottoms mm. up. Ooh. <laughs> 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 Get eyes on him. <laughs> the oh, ringtone. Thanks. Do you know 
know how hot it is out here? I'm melting. God, what asshole decided our uniforms had to be black? I'll be there as soon as I can. You freaking better. And bring something cold to drink. Or better yet, ice cream. Is vanilla No, okay? vanilla. <laughs> Seriously, I'm getting heat stroke over here. I'm gonna die. <laughs> you want that? Do ya? I love this. This is amazing. <laughs> he does not love Wish his job. Wish you were here, partner. Reno? I'm guessing. Ah, this is too good. They're looking for... So yeah, it was an attempt on Palmer. I, it, I did not clock that in last time. I think I did too late. No, oh, I didn't. Okay. Oh, your little shit. Booyah! Oh hell yeah, my dudes! Okay, let me see. Oh shit. Oh shit, fuck. Oh boy. Oh boy, that's bad. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. <laughs> So badly. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Oh shit! Would have been cool. God, I'm so bad. Oh, I missed. <laughs> oh, Lord. I would grab the two. Would have been cool. Okay, that was good. Oh fuck, that was bad. Here we go. Fuck off. Oh, we won. Let's go. I did not destroy. I will say I did not destroy. But... <laughs> did you see that shit? Oh, they're not in the prison anymore. <laughs> Everybody could watch. the real deal kiddo i just provided the encouragement and thanks to you my prison's gonna be a goddamn palace good for you Ooh, so frosty <laughs> but here in the desert we like it hot fiery dangerous <laughs> yeah i'll bet now where's our guy <laughs> easy snowflake solemn gus is a man of his word are you scared I'll break my promise? Give us burn. 
That tunnel over there will take you where you need to go. Past all that quicksand like a slippery little sidewinder. And at the other end, one of my beautiful vultures will be waiting to guide you through the desert. Nice, yes. To be a good tourist. I like the vultures, We got old Shooty cool. McShooterson tied up nice and tight in a shack out in the scrapyard. Shooty McShooterson. But now he's all <laughs> yours. What? Turn him over. Give him his just desserts. It's your call to make. Party selection locked. Really? Why not? Why? I mean... Do you find Aerith? I mean, I'm down. That's fine. You guys moving on then? And what are you gonna do? Since you put Pico's name on the map, we'll stick around for a bit. Try and get a winning streak going. Besides, we still got a score to settle. Hmm, sure you'll be okay with on some? your own? No man with a bird is ever truly alone. That's cute. Hey, Cloud? I know you need to hit the road, but if you're ever itching to get back in the saddle, come around. Pico will be here. No, he'd love a victory lap. More races. If you want to race, just holler. Gotta make sure our ranch's name is on everyone's lips. Thanks to you, we made a killing out there. Woo! Now we just gotta square things away with Shinra. And with an articulate fellow like me leading the talks, that'll be a cinch. Don't suppose you're in the market for a charming young racing consultant. Mm. Don't the suppose you're in the market just for a charming young racing like, consultant. I can't hear this. <laughs> that was too good. All right, let's go. We are doing There's this. There's no way shot those people, right? Are there any other gun arm dudes who might have gone on a killing spree? Yes. We know him. He'd never do that. Well, we'll find out soon enough. It w you know what, guys? It would have been cooler if the game didn't show us that cutscene with Barrett and uh, the other dude. It would have been cooler if we hadn't known that it's definitely not Barrett. I would have preferred being like... Like... No way he did that, did he? What happened? You know, like, I would have preferred that. That would have been cool, but... I mean, it's fine. Let us see. We have... Uh, time healing. I think... I think we're good, actually. I think we're fine. I just want that. Wow. Okay. I do have those. Sorry. Oh my god. Here I come. Shit. <sighs> Unfair. That'll do. <laughs> All done. Nice. Thank you. Uh. What if I go like elsewhere? What's gonna happen? I can't call it Chocobo. So I'm not gonna go too far because it's gonna annoy me <laughs> to run back. But finally! Okay, I see, I see. Nice. I see rabbits. Yeah, we're gonna be able to be on Chocoback. Oh, maybe they're not rabbits, actually. 
Oh, not those. Oh, not those. With me. Yeah. Let's do this. Now. That'll do. That's that. It's on now. Wait, what is that? Have I seen that before? I think I have. I'm gonna try still. We do this fast. Oh, I have. Shit. Three times. <laughs> Here we go. Gotcha. No holding back. It's on now. That'll do. That's it. Oh, pressure. Let's do this. Uh. Keep it up. Yeah, it's useless to go too far, I think. Right now. Ask someone else to uh, to give you stuff because we all have the same inventory, but you can keep on running <laughs> speedrun strats <laughs> instead of like stopping to give yourself an item. You know. Pretty sure I must have seen those as well. Did we just flee? What happened? Huh? What? What has happened? We fleed? Storm's coming.
Finally, we have a new region, you know. Not good. No. Uh -huh. Not good at all. Yeah. What the fuck is that? <laughs> what is going on here? Run. That's not Damn normal. It. This way. <gasps> Barrett. Barrett. Move. There he is, the champion. <laughs> the man of the hour. Okay, please tell us what's going on. Cause like... Who's the dude? Is it Dine? <laughs> I'll be chewing on sand for weeks! If! <laughs> Thank God we found you. We were worried. You on the lamp, big guy? The hell I am! <sighs> what are you guys doing all the way out here anyway? Looking for whoever decided to shoot up the Coliseum lobby. They said the culprit had a gun for an arm. <sighs> they did, huh? Tell, Tell us me more. it wasn't you. It wasn't me. <laughs> Frankly, it might as well have been. Barrett, guild? talk to us. That's guild talking. <sighs> I know the man who murdered all those people. It's Dine. I'm pretty sure. Dine? Yeah. My best friend. Yeah. No, it was... Uh, it couldn't have been any other way. <laughs> it was four years ago. The Corral reactor had just gone up. And Marlene is Dine's Dine daughter. Dine and I had been to check it I out. Think. See what the deal was. But on our way back. Yeah. None of this makes any the sense. Same, yeah. That explosion could have brought down the whole mountain. He's even so wearing the, the same thing, I? I think. That's a damn good question. <sighs> but why does he have a gun as an Whatever. arm, though? We need to get back. Tell him what we found. Just like Barrett. They lost their arm together? Arms? Like, what happens? God. No. God damn. <laughs> Bad! Dine! It's the mayor. It's Shinra. They just showed up and started shooting. I think they're trying to cover up what happened at the reactor. To pin the blame on... Hey! Over here! Please. Don't. This ain't happening. God damn it. The village. Marlene and Eleanor might still be there. Yep. You ready? Yep. For what? <laughs> still so quick to throw in the towel, ain't you? Come on. He Damn thought it. he died or something, or he was taken. Do I have to do everything? That's Shinra how they lost has their a reputation arms. for safety to uphold. Which makes you liabilities. What a bitch. Oh, how very brave. She just killed him. What a crazy psycho. Holy Eleanor. shit. Marlene. Oh. Marlene. 
So Marlene's... I managed to get away, but I was bleeding out. Figured that was it. Until Doc Sheeran came along and saved me. Put me back together. Most of me, anyway. There was no saving my arm, so I made a call. The music is... <laughs> Instead of a normal prosthetic, I chose a means to an end. Guess Stein had the same idea. I guess he did. I resigned myself to the fact that he was dead, but if I'd known he'd survive too, I... So that's why Dain shot all those people? To get back at Shinra? I don't know. I saw him at the saucer, saw the bodies and the bullet holes. But that's not who Dain is. Whatever his faults, he's not a monster. If I can find him, talk to him. I know we can figure this out. Well, okay! What are we waiting for? I don't know if he's gonna want to talk, honestly. He's gonna be like, why didn't you look for me? No, no, no. No time like the present. Took my daughter. I mean, he could also be like, you saved my daughter. Thank you. But, uh... That was heavy. I'm so happy we're all oh, nice. Oh, we have dragon claws too, I forgot. Oh my god. I'm so happy we're getting backstory on, on Barrett because I've always wondered why, you know, why his arm is like that? What happened? Charging uppercut, nice. Oh, it's Star Shower. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah, okay. We're gonna use... It's just that she's gonna uh, lose two materia. That's... Because I could, I could use both of, the, of these two. Um... As like a party selection, I mean. Yeah, like that. I'm ready. <laughs> oh, man. Keep it together. About damn time. Ah! Piss my I'm too You're far. Done. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Come on. Okay, let's go. Bring it. My favorite. <laughs> Oh, love it. Love it. I can rest. And you're sure he's here? We're sure. How did he not die, though? Who saved him? Shinra? Like... Why would Shinra save him, though? Doesn't make sense. I'm sorry, but I need to do this alone. Barrett. Oh. Go. Makes sense. Okay. Makes sense, though. I respect that. He moves faster than in the remake, I feel like. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Uh, is there something here? That's weird. 
Okay. <laughs> Uh, okay, if I go in alone, I need a healing. Because I don't have one right now. I have... Okay, magic warning, yeah. We could... Oh, I do have one, but it's, it's not... It's not good. We should get this one. Like that. And honestly, I'm just gonna wing it like that. Chocobo and Mughal is my favorite. Ah, <laughs> oh, the music is so good. It hit me so hard uh, during the cutscene. The music, holy. I don't have a lot of health. Barrett, dude, what a chad. He's incredible, let me just say. Talk to him first before. <laughs> As I live and breathe, Barrett Wallace. He's not. He's not feeling Come good. On. Bless your heart, dropping by for Eleanor's birthday. What? It's Eleanor's birthday today. Hell, Marlene, set a place. Oh, for okay. Barrett. No, he is. <laughs> yeah, he's mind. looking fit as a fiddle. Oh, good question. She ain't with him. Where's Myrna? She ought to be here. Dine. What happened to you? Though, come to think of it, I don't see a gift, neither. But you ain't the kind to come empty-handed. God damn it. They look incredible like that with each of them having a gun like that. Holy. Hey. Hell's his kind doing here. You son of a bitch. Still living on Shinra's kill. No, man. It ain't like that. <laughs> <laughs> you here to help me? <laughs> He's here for you to take the load off your shoulders, right? Same old shit. Really hitting me, I don't know why. <laughs> Just you and me then. Right here. Oh, I don't right want to do now. this. Choke on it. 
I thought you were here to help me. Can't assess him. I didn't think of that. Shit. Oh my god, I'm so bad. <laughs> the best of friends together again. Ain't it beautiful? It's just good that Marlene is not here right now. Remember when we had that rat problem? Yeah. You and me set traps, and you got caught in one of them. Oh, I guess old yeah. habits die hard. <laughs> Ain't no bad. There he goes again, our fearless friend. Whoa. Get it together. Oh. What is that? Let's go. 
gonna be okay. Look at the right time, but uh, nope. <laughs> this ain't shit. Jesus, I'm getting. This is not going well. Let me just tell you. Get me. I don't know how to avoid that. To be honest, I have no idea. Still in it. Oh. <sighs> There's a steel skin. Yeah. Well, it's gonna be okay. Burn you, backstabbing son of a bitch. Okay, I mean, yeah, let's do the limit. We defeated him, but I'm not proud of that fight, guys. That was messy as hell. Holy. <laughs> Get on with it. No, I can't, yeah. 
It's over. Over? You think this is over? This ain't even close to over! <sighs> then end it. Kill me. Oh, wow. I can't live like this anymore. Ferret! What about Stay Marlene? <laughs> You'd like that, wouldn't you? A way out. But where's that leave me? Huh? <clears throat> I thought you wanted to help your own buddy! No wise words. Coward. When the going gets tough, he's gone. Yeah, you're right. About everything. I should have never believed him. But that money... Change our lives. Well, it changed them all right. It wasn't just him, though, you know, it was most of the town. I can hear her now. Eleanor, as clear as day, begging me to stop, give you the benefit of the doubt, saying you ain't done nothing wrong. But then who's gonna answer for what happened? Shinra, like... Oh, I know. Yeah. Shinra! Always Shinra! Oh. That's true. Just turn four. She's in Midgar. Look at that. She's got her mommy's eyes. <laughs> Hair, too. After everything went down, I didn't know what to do. Myrna was dead. And I figured you were, too. All I had was guilt and regret, and the weight of it was too much. But Marlene gave me the strength to carry on. She nearly died that day. House was about to come down when I heard her crying. And ever since, She's been my reason to get up in the morning. You took my baby girl oh, from me. God. You knew she meant the world to me. You knew, and still you took her. That's not true. You took everything from me. Everything and everyone. It could everyone. have gone just either ways, you know, but of course it Go in that route. Dying. We could go see Marlene right now. Oh. Look at me, Barrett. You think I want Marlene to see what her father's become? 
So Stop. sweet, though. With all this goddamn blood on my hands, how could I ever hold my daughter again? She's really pretty. <laughs> Sorry about that. Okay. Woo. Does he do this at all times? Oh, seeing Barrett struggle like that is just really. It's a lot, you know? That's why there was a space here. I see. was just yanking her chain. She has her... Uh... Same. That said, is it okay to let the director get involved like this? Were you going to stop him? So Gus double-crossed us? Armor. All units are to pull back now. Well, have fun down there, boss man. Uh, and she has her popsicle <laughs> ice cream thing. Post is out, Paul Man. Booking's canceled, Paul Man. Security's been slaughtered, Paul Man. You're talking about Penguin, Paul Man. <laughs> okay. That's Paul Man. And now you're going to pay! I'm a director, and you will show me some respect! Info error detected. Immediate correction strongly advised. Oops. Uh, let's see now. Don't I have assess right now? Don't I have assess right now? I don't. Who does? What the fuck? 
Why don't I have a cess? That's weird. Maybe I took it off for the battle square. Not battle square. The Colosseum of Beasts. Well, that sucks. Don't overdo it. I'm coming. One more Get shot. ready. That'll do. It's fine. I'm guessing it's uh, thunder. Jesus. <laughs> okay, I pad it up to here with you. Did we all get Berserker all of a sudden? No, we got Fury. prepared for this fight at all. We got your oh. Okay. We don't nobody has thunder. Oh, we have electric impulse. It's the weakness, of course it is. Oh lord. Jesus. Don't think you'll walk away from this. You're gonna feel this guy. Come on. Divine Pamash. Sure thing. That's new. I haven't seen that before. That was crazy. Cloud, please do a focus trust. Ah, uh, did we miss? Okay, please heal me. You're gonna regret that. Take 
Unleash an already extreme of a chromatic attack. A chromatic attack so you can increase the stagger. Oh, I should have done on the uh shit. Significantly like Wow. On it. Uh, what summon do you have? Phoenix? Sure thing. Why not? I've been dying to see you. Because I don't think we have brand new right now. has her limits. I think she's gonna re be revived with that, isn't she? We're gonna get some help, right? She does not get revived. Okay. That's good to know. I will revive her, it's okay. Uh, let me use... A... To go and do your. <laughs> I won't let anyone help you. Ow. Wow. Good job, Cloud. That's amazing. Don't overdo it. Nee, 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 nee. <laughs> Don't think you'll walk away from this. I I don't know what I did. Oh Lord. No more No. Attacking the legs, I didn't notice the help. <laughs> that was messy. I'm I'm not playing well today. I'm sorry, guys. I don't know what's up with me. We didn't have a says. That was sad. Would have been cool. I wonder who has it. If I don't, no one, I guess. We gotta go. They'll be on us any minute. They're on us now! That's us? Wow. Fear not, friends! No. Your chariot awaits! 
Dio? <laughs> I've been using this to eavesdrop. Can never be too careful. Okay. But you are innocent. And I was wrong. He's like, I'm not innocent. Because he way has of all apology, that guilt, you know. I gift you this. So now we go you around the desert with that burial, I promise instead of chocolate back. Thanks. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's go! <laughs> um, is this not a bit much, sir? Hmm. The safety of my every guest is paramount. <laughs> I don't know what happened in Midgar, but to me it matters not. The cape. You are always welcome, my friend. You can have a good handshake as well, Cloud. A strong hand. Okay. Does anyone know how to drive this thing? Leave it to me, lass. You can't even see. Barrett. He said he wanted me to live with the guilt. Well, we're here for you. <laughs> to help take the load off. Huh? I mean it, man. No. <laughs> yeah, I'm starting to think you might. Oh. Come on. It doesn't take me much today. <laughs> Lord, I'm tearing up all episodes. Looks like this is goodbye, old buddy. You have a proper burial. Chaos unfolding beneath the saucer. Give the Shinra forces a taste of their own ballistic medicine as you attempt to shake their pursuit. Level aim, speed, steer, fire, reload, overcharge. Sorry. 
I'm not even on anyone. I'm just, I'm concentrating. Gotcha. <laughs> it's hard to, uh, to control the vehicle as well, Let's you know? This. Bring it. Buggy. In the buggy, I guess. Okay, no. Okay. The ones who don't deserve, like dying. <laughs> How'd I do? Really Just good. Just fine. <laughs> I'd like to think Dine would have been proud. Yeah, I think he would. Mhm. Mm For sure. You made Shinra just slabs of meat. All the machine troops. Some dead you are. Mm. 
Long past time my little girl knew the truth. She doesn't know. She doesn't know. I mean, she's young, but still. You don't hide something like that. <gasps> I'm shocked. <laughs> Uh, if you don't mind my saying, you're in an awfully good mood. Well, it's been productive. Wait, there's too many things happening. <laughs> don't have too much fun. Why was there like a Kate sit deactivated in the background? What the fuck? Like not moving or was it a you plushie? Called, like I don't think it was. What is the status of the ancient? We still have eyes on her. Is she looking for the promised land? We don't believe so. I see. Is she a higher priority than the materia? Hmm. Not her so much as her birthright. It's a dream of mine. To see it with my own eyes. Understood. We'll step up surveillance. I'm confused. I'm confused. I'm sorry, I'm gonna pause because there's so many things going on. First of all, the Kate Sid, like I said, is so strange. Unless there are multiple of them that are exactly the same. What is that? I thought it was like a species, but they are like it was exactly the same thing. So is it like a Shinra thing? Like Shinra sent, you know, like a special troop or something like that? No, I don't trust that cat at all. He fooled me with the Scottish accent. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's just that there's two of them. But the one behind was like not doing anything. It was like deactivated or something or just sleeping. I don't know. It's always smiling, so you never know. But they didn't show that for no reason. Do you know what I mean? They show that to be like, isn't that weird player? You know? <laughs> God. Isn't that weird player? Did you see that? Isn't that weird? <laughs> also, I because I was thinking of that, I was like, what the fuck? I didn't notice on the monitor. I will need to check when I'm editing, but... That dude, Reeve, is not really liking what's going on, you know, with everything. So was was he helping for the avalanche, whatever thing? Wait a minute. Wait, maybe this is the other timeline. I just had a thought that maybe this is the other timeline. Because the third thing that I wanted to talk about is Rufus. Rufus has said in the past, I, my, my father is dead. There is a new, a new version of Shinra coming. I have new goals. Whatever how he said it, he didn't say it like that. But he doesn't care about the promised land. Why doesn't he suddenly care? Why does he suddenly care? Is this the other timeline and I'm just fucked because of that? It would make sense for Kate Sith. Now he's not at the same place, you know? But he's the exact same person. That's materia, like underground? <laughs> no? It's a dream of mine. How cute. Who are you? Really? Oh, come on. 
You know me. He has like a Sephiroth Genova stuff going on. Purple. And I know you, Mr. President. You and your fears. <laughs> Still just a child, aren't you? Is it Sephiroth? A pig-headed, pathetic, daddy-hating child. And under that bratish exterior, loneliness. I don't deny it. Why would I? It's brought me all this. Now that's the spirit I'm looking for. We really need more people like you. To give the world a shot in the arm. But what do you truly want? so many questions <laughs> I cannot deal right now I am now we're in the okay so yeah maybe it's really the other timeline Rufus or something I need to see the the monitor again I need to stop playing actually let's start this manhunt oh yes 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 yeah. <laughs> I'm so happy. Honeybee Inn is here. Um. I need to stop. I thought maybe I could, um. What do they say about the story? Interlude, a world apart. And then you have episodes. That is interesting. It might not be... You know, it might not be Rufus and everything from this timeline. It might still be the other. I didn't notice the reactors, like which one were up and which one were not when he looked outside. And the, on the... Okay, what is making me like, what the fuck is the cat being there in the background? And the monitor, he was like... Uh, Reeve was doing something with the... Um, Bounty, the bounties on their heads, on avalanche heads. And you know, in this timeline, Tifa, Barrett, Wedge, Jesse are like crossed out because I guess they're dead or they're captured. I think dead, probably. Um, so I thought, okay, maybe. <laughs> Maybe now he was like being like, oh, we don't need those bounty anymore. I, I, I wish I could rewind and watch that cutscene again because I wouldn't have those questions right now, I guess. When I'll be editing, I, I'll see. But uh, I was too focused on the cat. I was like, why is Kate sit there? Why? How? Um, but uh, and then Rufus being like, ah, oh, the promised land, like being different, you know? That's what made me think, oh, are we like in, are we in another timeline? And then they put us in another timeline, so I'm like, okay, but I, it still could be ours. It's just a bit strange. The only re, the, the only, no reason, but, um, excuse. I could, I could be like, oh, this is our current timeline is 
maybe there are multiple cats like that or it was just a plushie and there are bounties on their heads as well in our timeline so he was just like updating them i guess and then rufus i just misunderstood his goals but strange very strange guys this was a really emotional episode for me i'm gonna say this was uh i did not expect that i mean i felt i think it's because i love barrett so much you know but they were still able to make us feel for a character we've never met before like barely and they they wrote it in a way and the of course the performance of the actors is absolutely amazing but you know the music the, and they wrote it in a way that really made you feel for for dine and for barrett well obviously barrett but and you know with marlene and i wish he could have survived and get help like mental health help and get better and then he would have been able to see marlene but i don't know if it would have been, it would have been good for marlene like it's her it's her dad but he's not doing so good right now you know so <laughs> this this um npc just stumbled I love that because the world feels lived in, if that makes sense. Like, I'm just talking like that and there's this person being completely lost and stumbling around. Like, I don't know, it's so cool. And it's it's probably on the loop, but like on a really long one, I guess. I don't know. Anyways. I have many questions. I have many, many, many questions. Uh, Glenn... It's the same dude we've seen in Junon. He has, like, you know, he looks like a robed man, let's be honest. Like, first time we saw him, I was like, Reunion. Like, he, he's, he looks, you know, like like them a little bit, but he's from Wutai. And he did not have that purple shit magic the first time we saw him. I don't think so. But now he did. So also a different timeline or what? Like, and, and his, um dialogue he was like i know your fears like he knows rufus really well that was strange and then the purple shit going on that's like trademark sephiroth slash genova to me every time we see purple magic like that black and black and purple you know um it's genova or sephiroth doing something right so Wow, what? Like, what is that about? Uh, are you working with Genova? Was it a hallucination? Hallucinations from Genova. You know, Genova does hallucinations. They've said that multiple times, but we don't really know how, to what extent, I guess, it can work. But when we fight a Genova Dreamweaver and Genova Emergen, was that the name? the other Genova anyway that we fought um, on the boat you know they say oh we can induce hallucinations Genova la 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 so is that what just happened it was like Genova taking the form of Glenn and being like I know you bitch or something I always felt like Genova was not really sentient in a way that I know she is but she's kind of like not really alive anymore i guess she's like in a million pieces <laughs> i don't know like an arm is missing a head is missing like <laughs> is she you know like i mean she still lives like her cells i guess but she's it, it, does she have like a consciousness <laughs> i don't think so like i always thought she didn't so maybe it's Sephiroth? Like, I, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> or Glenn is just, also has uh, Genova cells. So like using that kind of power. I, I don't know who Glenn is, to be honest. He's just like a Wu-Tai dude. He is, um, he's actually much more than that. You, no, was it Yuffie? Yeah, Yuffie told us during, uh, you know what cloud started feeling worse and he was like oh, almost going you know in the mines in coral in coral mines yeah coral mines uh yuffie was like oh he uh overthrew 
he he was like a revolutionist wasn't it like he overthrew the government in wutai or something that's what she said right glenn and other people and they were like yeah and then nah and or something i don't remember but yeah so he's he's much more than just a dude from wutai like a random dude from wutai also he got shot in the back by rufus in the past we saw that like as a flashback Okay, like, I, 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 I don't know, I don't know, I, uh, is it something like, uh, okay, he did his revolution, and then went head-to-head -head with Rufus and Shinra, and then, or head-to-head -head with President Shinra, you know, about to kill him, because Wutai and, and Shinra was in a war right and then rufus younger rufus was behind and he didn't see rufus and he got shot in the back and almost died from that and then for some fucking reason like hojo hojo is his type he like took his body and then gave did experiments on him or something and then gave him genova cells and then he escaped is that what happened like something like that something crazy like that you know like hojo doing his thing you know like just doing experiments all the time <laughs> is it something like that because we saw he got shot in the back so and now he has powers like genova like <laughs> i don't know guys <laughs> i don't know but um one of my theories got answered today for sure which is Marlene is not the biological daughter of Barrett. I had that theory from Remake, so we got that answered. All the rest is pretty much still theorizing, you know? I don't know anything, but um, I'm gonna keep an eye on Kate Sid. Honestly, I don't like that at all, that he was suddenly in Shinra's building for... I mean, maybe it was not him, but like his species or... Or is he a species? I thought he was like red, maybe, but maybe he's a construct. I, I don't know. Like an activated, deactivated type of thing, because he seemed he seemed deactivated and like a, like this. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I'm going crazy. <laughs> this is so good. This was so 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 good. Oh, here's the loop, but it's not exactly the same loop. With the NPC, it's a little bit different. Didn't stumble at the same place. Interesting. And the loop is quite long. I've been talking too much, is what it means. I love this chapter, this episode, I should say. I think it was great. I really got hit in the feels, got super emotional with Barrett and Dine. I think it was really well written. And yeah, um, sorry for my runny nose and everything during that time because I was tearing up like nonstop. Like, not, not crying, sobbing, you know, but almost all the time. Like, always tearing up every five minutes. Like, come on, game. Please, help me out here. <laughs> Anyways, so, I hope you guys enjoyed still. And, um, yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Bye!